What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. You already know what today's video is. We got tractors rolling by. We're out here in the sticks. We're up at a new bike park. Well, new for us that we've never been to. It's called Highland Park in New Hampshire. And then tomorrow we're going to Thunder Mountain. But we're going to test the Walmart bike at Highland Bike Park. We're heading to Walmart right now. But I got to land this trick first try. I haven't even touched my bike yet. Oh! <laughs> Guess I didn't tighten my back wheel. <laughs> sketch! The morning crush. Alright. That'll wake you up real quick. We made it. Thought there was more options than there actually are. There's not a lot that happens. Full suspension. A lot of them don't even have uh, one disc brake, which we need one disc. It's heavy. It's hard. One looks worse than the other bike and it's more expensive. About four and a half inches of grip right here. Walmart, stop number one, no good. Full suspension preferred. Bus suspension. I just recently messed with the settings and the tune and it is sounding much better. Less poppy, more gurgly. Slaps. They hate it, honestly. It's not their car. A little bit of spirited driving while we're up here. Take number two. Brakes. Brake check. Look at the rims on this thing. <laughs> we have front and rear disc brakes on this bike, but we only have front suspension. We do not have rear suspension. We're gonna see how it lasts. Might be rocky. I think it'll handle 175. So this bike is $25 more than the last bike. You guys said we should have done a little repair on the bike before we rode it. We didn't tune anything, we didn't do anything. Now we got some tools. Looks like they did a pretty good job tightening the stem on this bike. Even though this tool is garbage, it's made of plastic. This is the bike and the dimensions. Kent International, 27 and a half men's. I think it was the fourth time I bought a Walmart bike. The first two were BMX, the last one was a mountain bike. I finally learned that you can use this machine. Try to bring the front tire. Look, it doesn't even protection plan? No. I don't think we're gonna need that. Yeah, decline. Dude, again, bro? I'm gonna need you guys to go buy some merch. I didn't even swipe it and decline it. Proof. Money. <laughs> Back wheel. Oh, the wheel! <laughs> Wait till the mountain pop. She's looking clean. Oh man! <laughs> and we're pulling up to the yard sale. <laughs> Seal. Quick giveaway intermission. If you guys want to win the products in this photo right here, just comment where in the world you're watching from. Anybody in the world can win. I'm gonna pick a random comment in a few weeks, so stay tuned and good luck. We weren't gonna spray paint it, but it's actually a necessity. Neon pink paint with the exact bike that we're riding on it with front disc brake, no rear suspension. But I think it was meant to be. Could have paint the front brakes this time because a lot of beef in the comments and stuff like that. So we're just gonna keep it like aesthetically pleasing. Tires look good. Focus on those brakes, bro. This is brake cleaner, <laughs> is it not? It's nice that it's rain too, it'll stick just as good. Yeah, the rain's adhesive. It's good for the bearings, make sure to get the pads. This actually makes the brakes work a lot better. Only cry on for my brakes, it's the only shit I rock. Can we do it to my car next? Of course, <laughs> I have it on all my car. Show them, the brakes ain't trash. 
any bike that we ride wouldn't be uh, complete unless we have the FTL frame bag on there. We're gonna put all the GoPro batteries in here, our keys and wallet. Inside detail. You There's know, zipper pocket in here too with the FTL elephants printed all over. Uh, Waterproof I zipper. See. So you, you have know. your phone in there. Proper. My favorite blue. Right over the paint. Proper. Now it bikes look good. You know, the last Walmart mountain bike video, I asked what mountain bike I should get and there was a lot of people who had a lot of opinions on it. Gave me amazing recommendations on what mountain bike to get. It helped me limit down my choices a little bit. I still haven't made a decision. I want to tell you what kind of riding I'm going to be doing. I would say more BMX style riding. Yeah, I'm not into the rock guards. I'm into like the big jumpy stuff. Big burns, big lips, all that. I also want a 27.5. Let me know in the comments, oh, yeah. please, what bike I should get. Everybody on the lift was like looking at the bike, laughing, thinking it's, it's funny. They were showing a lot of love, honestly. Yeah. It's pretty cool. And then one kid behind us wanted to race Jason down whatever line that Jason wanted to go down. Jason said he'll race him. Whoever wins gets to keep the other person's bike. So we got Wally on the line. Wally's on the line, but if Jason wins, he's coming home with a downhill bike. We're going to strap up to the roof of our car. <laughs> Let's get it. We'll see you at the top. You're going to race down the mountain. Stephen Thorne versus Jason Stelter. Hasn't been down the mountain yet at all. And your bike looks really nice. I don't know what it is, but it looks, looks like it can go fast. Solid, just... Wet. Sounds good. Let's get a sound test. Sounds even better. We're gonna need a clean race down the mountain, boys. All right. No, no eye poking. No eye poking. <laughs> All right. We'll see you at the bottom. Start that. Oh, Wally is cruising. Jason's coming in! Jason's on his ass! Oh my god, Jason! He's cutting in! <laughs> Two thirds down the trail. They were neck and neck pretty much the whole time. One, dropping. Jason boogieing down the mountain. God damn. Woo oh, he's cutting. <laughs> cutting through. Oh my god, this is so sick. Get him, dude. Oh, oh my god, I almost landed on you. Jason! Wally with the victory! <laughs> Oh, dust! You good? Oh! You good? Everybody looking for a new bike. 
Size small, I don't think it's gonna work for you, Jason. I think we're gonna have to we're gonna have to take the better bike. Sorry, you don't get to keep the our precious bike. She handled. Jason's up there right now. He's gonna be sending this big jump on the Walmart bike. Oh, he's sending it. Yo! Absolute madman. Yeah, it was so sketchy. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's bottom now on this. What's really cool about Highland, this giant tent behind me is an indoor skate park. Swimming pits and resis and stuff like that. Day two of the Walmart bike test. Today we are at a different mountain, Thunder Mountain Bike Park in Massachusetts. This will be the third lap down the mountain. So far, so good. She's handling very nicely. We were going down uh, a blue line. Yeah, sleeping day. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Oh, here we go. Tech stuff. She's handling those suspension in the back. Bottoming out on everything. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god, I can't. What? My chain pop! Oh. Hold on, hold on. Alright, problem number one of the day. You got it? Yeah, I guess we're good. You want me to take this thing over? Jason's taking over. Halfway down the mountain, she's ripping. Jason's smoking me. Jason's got the wheels on the Walmart bike! He's cooking it!
something feels loose. That passed the test. The brakes were good. So maybe some better uh, handles, like some shorties or something, so I can actually hold on. And uh, some real grips, real pedals. Yeah, we need those pedals need to be changed out for sure. But, maybe uh, a new derailleur. Yeah. Forks, forks the, maybe. Derailleur delete. We could do that. Three pretty solid runs down the mountain. We took it. He hit the big feature yesterday at Highland. Handled that. So this bike, honestly. Pass for me, 175 bucks. Not trying to spend four grand. Look at the condition it's in. A better one than the, uh, the one at Creek lasted. Yeah, it lasted really good. So we're gonna give this bike away. Wally's coming home, boys.